got its own dharma, duty. What is the duty of love? He says, it is the duty of love to inquire with your beloved what pleases them. So Bharata, you being the embodiment of love here, you must inquire with your beloved Rama in what lies his happiness. You must not thrust your happiness on him. So therefore ask Rama in what lies his happiness. This is the wisdom of Chanaka. And then Bharata understands. Everybody understands the sublimity of life itself here. And then Bharata falls at Rama's feet and says, Please tell me my beloved. Please tell me my beloved. In what lies your happiness? And Rama says, My dear, I have come for a task. And that task can only be fulfilled in this exile. And therefore I asked Mother Kaikeyi for this boon. She did send me here. I asked her to ask for these books. And then I am going now to complete the task for which I have come. My devotees are waiting for me, he says. And then Rama gives his Padukas to Bharata. And Bharata receives the Padukas of Sri Rama and he says, Until you come back, I will reside right here in the forest. I am not going back to the kingdom. I will dress like you. I will walk like you. I will eat like you. I will not go back to the luxuries of the life when you, my beloved, are going to live like this, he said. And he never went back to Ayodhya from that day. On a beautiful mud throne that he constructed with his own hands, he placed the Padukas of Swami. And he said, these Padukas of Swami is the ruler of this kingdom. And I am a humble servant. He sat down at the feet of the Padukas and he gave his, whatever Rama taught him, Days on that, he gave that instruction to Shatrugna, who was actually running the administration in the kingdom during those 14 years. 